Hello, what's the crack? What's the story? Welcome or welcome back to the channel. Due to popular demand, we're checking out more Milton Jones. This is Milton Jones live at the comedy store. This was 13 years ago. Have you seen this? Let's go. Horse whisperers. Horse whisperers. What they do is they go up to horses and they go, <laughs> and the horses go, okay, fair enough. Beware Chinese horse whisperers. <laughs> they go up to horses and they go, That horse tells another horse. <laughs> that horse tells another horse. By the end, the last horse is going, I don't know if this is unusual, uh, but did anyone here have to have your brother or sister's bath water? <laughs> on your cornflakes? <laughs> My auntie Jean got a sister called Jean. Her daughter, Jean, just had a baby, called it Jean. Okay. They all went to a nightclub to celebrate. They got to the door and the bouncer said, sorry. You're all wearing trainers. <laughs> My grandfather, Jean, <laughs> always complaining about how much things cost. One pound fifty for a cup of tea, one pound fifty for a cup of tea. I said, well, you just popped round. I didn't invite you. <laughs> I'm a bit annoyed at the moment. Sorry, he's got he's got a style that's that really suits him, that suits his personality. I'm sure if some comedians try doing this, this you know, this same routine, it's not gonna be as funny. You know, the timing of what he does, it's so good. He's so so good. Fair play. I'm a bit annoyed at the moment. I just bought one of those off-road vehicles, uh, three thousand quid. Got it home, found out it was a canoe. <laughs> you know what it's like though when you're driving down the motorway and you see a sign for Barnstable and everyone in the car starts going OR <laughs> OR Barnstable OR and then you see a sign for Birmingham and everyone in the car starts going I'm from Birmingham, yeah. <laughs> I live in Birmingham, so yeah, that's true. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> I was expecting that at the end. Mm. Oh, God. Oh, God. Colin. You know, when you're in a relationship, oh. what's that like? <laughs> I almost had a date once. I think I sounded too enthusiastic. She said, come around after three. I went, one, two, three. <laughs> Tell me, does anyone here have a cat? Yeah. Yeah. Your houses stink. <laughs> Someone's got to tell them. See, some people like cats and some people don't. I was reading the other day, apparently the Pope, uh, he's a cataholic. <laughs> oh, Catholic. Oh. <laughs> that almost went over my head. Cataholic. Cata. Oh, okay. First job I ever had. Working in a supermarket, yeah, Catholic, well done. Yeah. <laughs> First 
job I ever had. <laughs> Working in a supermarket. It was my job to hand out samples of things for people to taste. Uh, but I was asked to leave after the little cups of bleach incident. <laughs> After that, I worked in a pathology lab. Uh, but I was asked to leave after one of my reports said, Cause of death, autopsy. <laughs> <laughs> Easiest job in the world, of course, Australian psychiatrist. Good day, good day. How you doing? No worries. Next. <laughs> I went swimming the other day. This girl came off the top board, missed the main pool, landed on me as I was crossing the foot bath. <laughs> Women divers. <laughs> <laughs> so there's someone down here just going, <laughs> Which part of Birmingham are you from? I obviously loved that, especially the Birmingham joke. That was banging. I was expecting that. I want to go, ee, and then it, Birmingham. <laughs> that was quality. That was quality. Please, please keep telling me more of Mitten Jones, which one to check out. On any other comedians, happy new year to you guys. It's the 31st today. So if you guys are seeing this, it should be out. Yeah, it should be out on the 31st. Hopefully, fingers crossed. Yeah, thanks for your support. I appreciate you guys. Make sure you subscribe. Comment down below. Just keep supporting me. And I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.